Hey comrades, Mr. Anime here, and I'm here to review one of the worst things ever made, and it's a fellow anime reviewer. Yes, I'm talking about the Irate Gamer. Oh, no, I mean Nostalgia Critic. I'm reviewing Nostalgia Critic. Now, one of my darkest secrets is that I used to love the Nostalgia Critic, and to be honest, I find some of the older videos actually to be entertaining. But nowadays, he reviews new movies. His name is Nostalgia Critic. He's supposed to review nostalgic things. That's the first thing you're supposed to get right. And even worse, instead of waiting for the, for the movie to release out of the years, he remakes the movie for the review. Why? Why would you do this? Not only does it make it so that Doug can twist the movie how he wants, it's not funny. It's like if I started reviewing my own skits in a critical eye right after I made them. This could be an opportunity to do the scene better than how the movie did it, but it's just a worse version of the movie. He's creating worse versions of the movies he's critiquing. Even when the movie has been out, he still turns it into a stupid skit. Now, let's look at these actors he's been using. Doug Walker screams about everything. He doesn't know how to tie a tie. And the black nerd comedy is way better. Tamara... Tan... Tamara... T uh, what, however you say her name. Is clearly this actor from Austin and Ally from the Disney Channel. And uh, I don't like that character. Rob Walker rhymes with Bob Talker. And I hate that guy. Malcolm Ray is actually a pretty good actor. He's above average. I don't know. He kind of saves it for me. He's probably one of the best actors. I love his portrayal of Obama. It's better than normal Ob Obama. I mean, look at how tall he is. That's like four feet tall. Malcolm is one of the best actors of our time. It's not just these stupid skits. It's how he treats the normal format too. He explains the entire plot with some jokes throughout. This could be okay if he actually had something to say other than the plot, but he doesn't. These reviews can just be used to replace the movies. And come on, are you going to watch this? Also, I think we all know that Doug Walker is a world-renowned criminal. He slaughtered many children, and I don't support it. Remember to like and subscribe so I can evade more taxes.